So Florida Surgeon General saying that if you are fully vaccinated, you don't need to be wear a mask or avoid crowds. The new advisory comes just days after the CDC updated its guidelines for outdoor mask use. And there's some differences here which can really confuse the public. News for Jack's reporter Ashley Harding showing us live from the newsroom. And Ashley, the advisory doesn't actually end any mask mandates. No, it doesn't, but I have the three-page memo right here, and it specifically says that fully vaccinated people should no longer be advised to wear face coverings or avoid social gatherings except in limited circumstances. Now, this does not list what those limited circumstances are, but Dr. Scott Rivkeeds is rolling back several other policies, and that includes expanding vaccine eligibility to non-Florida residents. He says it's to make sure that no vaccinations go to waste. Now, he also says government businesses should go back to in-person operations. Now, the Surgeon General's advisory on masks is quite a bit different from the CDC's latest guidance Earlier this week, the CDC updated its recommendations for outdoor mask use for those who are fully vaccinated. It says that fully vaccinated people can now unmask at small outdoor gatherings or when eating outside at a restaurant with friends from multiple households. Now, if you're not vaccinated, you should still wear a mask at such gatherings. Even if you have been vaccinated, still avoid large indoor gatherings. Now, just a reminder, you are not considered to be fully vaccinated until two weeks after your second dose. That's for the Pfizer and Moderna vaccines. For the single dose Johnson & Johnson shot, it's two weeks after that.